Hi, I'm Creo and this is how to put a 3D object in your video. No 3D elements, here's one and here's some more. Ow. So, welcome to Blender. This is the easiest way to learn Blender. You use like five keys to, to become a professional. You select the cube, press G to move it, easy. You press R to rotate, S to scale it up and down. I mean, it's really intuitive, yeah? And of course, to move around in space, you use scroll and move the mouse. You shift with that and you can move. Damn, that's really simple. Things you need to make this 3D object in, in your any video. You need, you need a video. I mean, like, film it, come on. That's easy. Second part is using the app called Google Street. It's an app that makes a fake HDRI because it isn't the real one, but it gives the lighting thing to your object. So it's pretty good. You, you should try it, man. Now, delete that cube. Make a plane. Bigger plane. Import the clip you made. Set the perspective. It should have still a key. Nice. It's easy. To scale, make it more believable. Now, let's build some walls. You get a wall. You get a wall. Everyone gets a wall. After that, for this whole turn on shadow catcher, because we want that background, that sweet background. Now for the 3D model. You can you can use whatever. I mean, uh, it's I, I like cars. I'm gonna use this car. It's a bit too small. Make it bigger. Put that fake HDRI because it's not real. But I'll make make something. You know, play with the light. Try to recreate everything from the shot. Scale, grab, rotate. You did learn the basics, yeah? And now, this is the important part, the rigid body physics. Make your object active, because it's gonna fall. Everything else passive, pretty rigid. Press play, and you did it. Good job. Now render, and it crashed. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, not in here. There's there's even no space in this room. Ugh. Well, this is a pointless video anyway, because if it's a static shot, you can do this, 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 this. So this was all pointless. Thank you for watching my video and bye.